A retired forester, Solomon Queno, has criticized the conversion of Achimota Forest and other forest reserves into refuse dams, prayer camps, and residential facilities. According to him, such acts contravene the goal of natural habitat and must be halted if the country is desirous of natural benefits. The Achimota Forest, Ghana's biggest reserve in residential catchment area, continued to struggle to maintain its status largely due to human activities. The forest area, apart from it being reduced in size from its original land area, is faced with constant encroachment from religious activities and developers. These and many other attacks on both natural and conserved areas, retired forester Solomon Queno thinks is inappropriate. He wondered why some Ghanaians treat the environment with impunity, yet turn round to praise similar facilities in Europe and America. Them in short order to Bola, refuse dumps, high end residential sites, and prayer camps which predictably end up as residential sites. Professor Tufo has thrown a challenge to us all as a people by confronting us with the facts as they are. A word to the wise should be enough. Solomon Queno made these observations at the launch of a book, Managing Ghana's Forest Resources for Sustainable Development, by a pioneer forester and retired lecturer, Professor Kwabana Tufo in Accra. Professor Kwabana Tufo traced the visible environmental effects on Ghana's resources, including the pollution of water bodies and biodiversity losses due to consistent abuse of the natural environment. We're swimming in the Beautifully in the revenues, but so I think I see never dry, but soon the revenue um, they soon be dry. Professor Tufo further called on Parliament to pass laws that will help restore sanity in forest management. To see how they will uh, help us to get policies that will uh, enhance management so that we can get all the goods and services that are derived, can be derived from forests. Minister for Lands and Natural Resources, Kweku Asamwatreme, acknowledged the challenges of effective management of Ghana's renewable natural resources. Our forest resource base is very fragile and will certainly require careful planning of development strategies and investments to guarantee the permanence of forests as potentially sustainable source of goods and services. Among these key factors are over-exploitation of forests and wildlife resources, excessive land degradation through mining activities, and lack of sustainable farming practices.